Hey what's up people Vishal here and in this video I'm gonna show you how to record Android games on PC at 60 FPS. So in this I'm using an Android emulator to play my Android games and uh, you can use any kind of emulator you want like ND or Bluestacks or any many others are there in market. So in this I'm using the ND emulator to play my Android games there you can use Bluestack 2 uh, I'm not showing you how to install these but they are fairly simple and you can install them just read the on screen instructions and install it next we need uh, the recording software and I'm using the open broadcast software because it's free open source and you can even live stream to twitch or youtube if you want so let's get started just uh, download from here and install it and now open obs but before that you have to start your emulator uh, so that uh, our step will be fairly simple to proceed uh, so I had already started my ND emulator here uh, next go on OBS uh, let me remove that so that I can show you from starting so first of all we need to add scenes okay scenes is what uh, the window or frame it shows you can add multiple scenes and switch it between two uh, just uh, show different scenes on screen so right click on here add scene just name anything you want I am uh, I will show you the clash of clan recording here so I will rename it at clash of clans next thing we have to add sources this is where uh, we gonna add the source or where we are uh, recording the things is so we are recording the ND source so just right click on here go on add and uh, click on game capture okay we don't need to uh, window capture we need game capture just name it anything I will keep it as game capture here uh, in application just select the ND uh, whatever emulator you have open it so just keep on note that you have to open ND before you uh, selecting the game capture because uh, it will only show the open applications not closed one okay so click ND if you want to show your mouse cursor then check this uh, I will uncheck it because I don't want to show my mouse cursor inside the game just click OK now next thing we have to do the settings uh, to record the game on this so go on settings here or you can select the settings from here just click on settings journal leave it as it is we don't want to show it anyways just go on encoding here uh, you can select the bitrate or the quality you want so the encoder I have uh, installed is x264 it comes default okay so don't worry about this uh, two things the quick thing is for Intel uh, onboard graphics and Nvidia I really don't know what was what so next thing if uh, the CBI is selected for you just uncheck it the put the quality balance to 10 keep the maximum bitrate around 8 to 9000 I've put it to 9000 just uncheck the custom buffer select the audio as AAC bitrate uh, you can switch it to 128 or 192 anything I just keep it to 192 clip apply next thing we have to go on the video now here just uh, select your graphic card or the onboard graphic anything you are using okay so I'm using GT 520 single graphic card so just select it in uh, custom in resolution you have to uh, select the custom and uh, just keep the uh, if you're using ND just select the 128 by 800 
this is because uh, the resolution of ND is different from the resolution of your screen if you want to record the whole screen just click on monitor and it will uh, record the whole screen but if you just want to record the game Android game in ND or whatever blue stack you want so just uh, watch out the just check what resolution is uh, your emulator is running on so in case of ND just uh, go on ND tray icon right click settings and set resolution here uh, it is currently at 1280 by 800 so we will put 1280 by 800 okay uh, click on apply next thing uh, we have to go on advanced and just check this allow 61 to 120 fps this will allow your allow obs to record uh, the game above 60 fps so you can actually record your game up to 120 fps okay hit apply if it is not checked apply and okay that's it that's the setting we want one thing i forgot to mention is the broadcast settings i'm sorry for that the broadcast settings here uh, we got the two modes which is live stream if you want to live stream on twitch and if you just want to uh, locally record it select file output I'm just uh, recording it locally so I will select the file output only then you have to select the file path okay so just browse it go anywhere you want to save your file I am uh, going to save it on the desktop recording the OBS and just put the file name anything you want but uh, I'm gonna put it coc because uh, clash of plans and dash and a dollar sign and capital T uh, I will tell you what is this okay so just save it and if you hover over the file path you will see a pop-up showing the commands uh, you have to you can use uh, to name your file if you are doing multiple recordings then it will sort out with the full uh, time or the year or the month whatever you want so the current I am using the full time which is dollar and capital T so coc dash dollar t which will put the name as coc dash the time the date and whatever it is on my recording next thing leave the buffer uh, as it is because I we not going to use it click on apply click hit ok and uh, that's it uh, now let's see how it records so open up the emulator open up your game Now one more thing uh, which we have to do is to resize the um, your game because if you don't want to show your this black uh, bar control bar uh, under this so you can resize and you just you can just record the game size only okay so if you want to do that you can preview the stream so that you can resize the frame of the screen so if you, if you want to resize it just go on this edit set scenes and if you when you select it you can see this red, red box around it just hold the shift and drag it just under it okay it will stretch out and now you have a game only showing in the OBS hit the edit scene again to apply it and that's it now let's record it to show you how it actually works so here we go my pc is a little bit slow because i am uh, recording this so it 
seems to be a little laggy, but it's not. Okay. Fairly bit uh, good and responsive. That's it, guys. Uh, let's stop this and let me show you the recording we had made right now. So here it is how it actually works yeah it's showing my again now it's actually recorded in 60 fps so here it is you can see the bitrate is 1312 kbps and the frame rate is 60 fps 58 to 62 okay guys thank you for watching and Please do comment if you want to know more about this. Thanks and have a nice day.